Howdy folks, it's the Tall Turtle here, and this is not the Copper Crew server. This is Minecraft, aka Minecraft Windows 10 Edition, aka Bedrock, aka the Better Together update, aka Minecraft Pocket Edition Become Everything Edition, aka Console Edition, but that better together is the clue there. You'll see I'm signed in. My name is a little different. It says the Tall Turtle 18 because I already have the Tall Turtle reserved for my Minecraft account. This requires the Xbox Live account, which is tied to the Minecraft account, but then it comes off my kid's name. So I had to create another account and it said Tall Turtle is already used by me. I don't know how to merge them. So that's the introduction. What are we doing here today? We are checking out the Better Together update. Because I own Minecraft Java Edition or PC Edition, I get the Windows 10 Edition for free. I finally bit the bullet and got it and downloaded it um, for a couple reasons. One, I wanted to check it out. And I two, there's a lot of people on YouTube, especially quote the pros who play through this and talk about it and they have no idea what they're doing. It's so different than the PC version. Um, I also have no idea what I'm doing, but I admit that and I'm a noob. So I kind of fit right in there. This fits right in with my demographic and what I'm looking for, my newbiness. So we're going to try it together. Um, I don't know if this is going to be a series yet or not, because I don't know how much I'm going to like it. It misses a lot of elements from the PC version. However, it's supposed to be faster, better, more stable, more reliable, and look better apparently. For example, the render distance is much higher than the PC version and all that stuff. So we're gonna give it a shot. I'm watching myself move my mouse around and there's my skin by the way. If you haven't seen my skin without armor, this is the skin I made for myself, for the Tall Turtle. So the Tall Turtle 18 and the Tall Turtle are the same thing, me, for both. So, let's get started. I didn't plan on talking that long about it, but let's go in here. I was going through some settings ahead of time. The only control I changed was for Sprint. I made R on the keyboard because it's easier than reaching control for me. And then that way, Shift is still Squat. Um, not using a controller, not using Touch, my profile. Nothing unusual there. Video, I turned the brightness up to 100. Um, I'm going to keep the HUD... Um, hide HUD off, everything else I think I want to keep on. I made the GUI as small as possible. Render distance I cranked up to 56. Now other people I've watched, can their render distance is 60, 60. Why mine stops at 56? I have no idea when other people get 60. I couldn't tell you. Plutonium mode, I forgot to Google that before I started. I'll have to look that up later, but it's on for now. Um, hide the paper doll. That's your little dude in the top left corner showing you what you're doing if you if you um, sprint or squat. It shows up what you're doing. Or if you're flying, it shows up what you're doing. I mean, so that for console, since this is pretty much console edition put all together. Um, outline selection, I may or may not turn on. In game player, yes. How'd I turn down to 51? We might have to change that. I already adjusted my safe area. And what else was down here? Um, that's what I wanted to do from there. There's one more thing I wanted to check. Oh, yeah, something else I forgot to Google back here is mob effects Z. I tried Googling that and found nothing. I have no idea what that means. I was going Google to Google it again, but I forgot. So anyway, I still have to look up the one deal that I just mentioned, which I forgot what it was. Oh, the plutonium mode. I still have to look that up. By the time you watch this, I've already looked it up and made adjustments to this. So don't worry about commenting about it. I already know by the time you see this. Everything else down here, music, is still way too loud. Let's turn that down. I like uneven numbers. Let's do 19. And I think that's all I needed to do there. It automatically saves. So we're just going to jump right in. It took four minutes of, four and a half minutes of whatever. I'm not going to do any realms, um, servers, I'll look at that stuff later. I do not have any friends. If you want to be my friend, send me an invite. I don't know how that works. Go ahead. Send me a, send me a friend invite. I'll check you out, I guess. Tall Turtle 18. Not the Tall Turtle. Tall Turtle 18. With a the. Alright, so here we go. Create new. Uh, where do you want to begin? New world, yes. 
Um, I do oh my. So I don't. These are locked. I don't know why. Other people online are trying to explain why they're locked, and everybody gives a different answer. I'm gonna admit I have no idea what that means. I'll look that up later because I don't really care right now. Create new world. Oh boy, what are we gonna call this thing? Because I've already used life in the slow lane. I've already used slow traffic keep right. I don't want to call it better together. That's the name of the update. Um, slow and steady. We already used that before. Um, slowness, slowness, and neatness. Let's call it slowness and neatness. Survival, difficulty. Let's not use a map. Let's not use a chest. Trust player permissions. Okay. Well, whatever. We'll just do member. Infinite world. Yes, I don't have a seed. I think I'm going to activate cheats. Let's see. Uh, achievements only uh, cheats off. Well, the reason why I wanted to activate cheats is because I wanted to show coordinates because it's an infinite world. And if I start wandering, it's not like PC where you can hit F3 and see your coordinates. If I start to wander, I'm going to, and I lose my stuff, I'll never find home again. Unless I spawn there. But if I wander and I don't die, I'll never find home again. So I wanted to show coordinates. But that's only if you activate cheats. Yet, I want my achievements to count. Um, hmm. Okay, well, I guess I will um, not activate cheats then. I guess I can do a starting map though, that'll tell my coordinates, and the reason why I'm okay doing a starting map now is because in console edition that I'm used to, we always had a starting map, always. So we'll turn that on, we will not activate cheats I guess, because I want my achievements to show up. Okay, well let's keep that, um, not multiplayer, no, so does that change anything here, no. Multiplayer, no, because the right is on, correct? Yes. Right is on. Multiplayer off. Resource pack. Um, just gonna be the default. How do I get this? How do I get this natural one? Oh. Unlock 490 M coins. Minecraft dollars. I don't want to add any Minecraft dollars. Let's go back up and do the default then. Behavior pack. Default. Resource pack. Default. Game. Okay, let's just create this thing. This has been a very long introduction. But hey, we're here to talk about this. And learn together. And we are going to learn together. I'm not going to pretend I know something I have no clue about. I just know that this is kind of oh boy whoa oh my this is huge oh okay okay this is very different feeling oh this is smooth holy moly this is really smooth i can see through my water too a lot of people complain that you can't see through the water but i can all right well you gotta find some trees first um, first thing I wanted to do, though, was take a screenshot. Because some people say you use Windows G. I'll try that. Alright. Oh, there we go. Take a screenshot. Windows all print screen. There we go. Take a screenshot. Gotta find that later. Uh, F5 still does this. Yes. Let's try this again with Mr. Piggy. Um, Windows alt print screen. Windows alt print screen. Took another screenshot. Okay. And my bandy cam is still running, obviously, because you're watching this. So that didn't get screwed up. Alrighty. What else can we do? What does F1 do? Hides everything. What does F2 do? F2 does nothing. F3 does nothing. F4 does nothing. I don't want to push the other ones because I might screw up my recording. Alrighty. So there's my GUI, or my HUD, way down there, nice and small. And there's my, um... It's, like, faded out on purpose. Does... Shift still does the dealio. Okay. And R still runs. Alrighty. Well, ooh, look at I see a desert temple right off the bat. Alright, well, let's head that way. Seems like every series I do and I record for y'all, I end up with a desert temple in my first, first go at it. Now, I think I can whack these guys pretty good without any weapons. Eh, come here. 
How many wax? How many wax? Just two. Yep, you're mine because I need some food. Wow, these sounds are different too. Um, okay. Man, I gotta turn down my volume for myself. Alrighty, let's um. Where does that desert temple go? Let's get some acacia trees. Oh, I should have a starting map. There it is. Can I put that in my offhand? I thought you could do map and arrows in your offhand. Weird. Okay, let's place to read this thing. Oh, it doesn't show coordinates. Oh, cheesy. Well, right in the middle of the map, that's where our stuff is going to be. Let's get going, though. Time goes really fast when you're having fun. Well, this is smooth as butter. Oh my gosh, this is smoother than PC. And it's supposed to be. So, even though PC has a lot more features like shields and, you know, the on-screen stuff you can do. And you can do mods and you can do a bunch of things like that. Um, this Better Together update is supposed to actually be better all around in terms of performance and behaviors and all that. And already, just out of the gate here, I am super impressed with this. I'm disappointed, though, that I have to buy the natural texture pack. Because um, you know I'm not a fan of default textures in Minecraft. They kind of bug me a little bit. Um, let's see here. Let's make some... Whoa. Let's make some... Wow. This is so smooth. If you haven't tried this, you have to try this. This is crazy. I don't know how to test my frame rate but we have to be in the hundreds of frames a second i know you can't see that but in pc i get about 400 frames per second and this is way smoother than that even or maybe it's not a 100 frames per second thing maybe it's just it's that that much smoother wow this is insane this is really neat and so far the controls are all the same as the PC version, or the Java edition, I guess, is more properly called. The um, only difference is there's no shields. For me, the only difference is there's no shields. And I can't run Optifine. And I can't run shaders, which are pretty big deals, to be honest. But, take away the modded aspect. And holy cow, this is amazing. I am really really already impressed I'm gonna spend my whole day here chopping on the street but that's okay that's my point that's why I came up here how much more wood is hiding that I gotta free up none I don't think all right let's keep going here it does have infinite worlds of course so that's fine I am able to control the brightness so that's fine now I will admit, it's a little bit lonely playing a single-player world right now. Because even though the Kapaku server... Aw, oh, shoot. Even though the Kapaku server doesn't have a whole bunch of people at once playing, it's nice just knowing people are around. So this is a little different. I know I can always join servers here, too, and such. There's the realms and everything, but um, I don't know anything about those, to be honest. So I'm going to have to do a lot of research before I do that. Okay. Here we go. Um, shall we? Should we make some stuff while we wait for some saplings to fall? I don't. I didn't forget any wood in there, did I? I don't think so. It seems to be deteriorating nicely. So let's. Wow. This. Whoops. I keep missing my click. But other than that, oh yeah, controls are all the same. Oh, this is nice. Wow. Um. I wanted some cobblestone though before I started. Let's try to... Uh, I guess we at least have to make a wooden pickaxe, if nothing else. And I need to take those out a second. Uh, let's make a few more of those. Let's make a pickaxe quickly. See, I have to like double click though. Every time I click on something, it seems to miss it. Hmm. Come on, that, oh, that took a long time. Alright, let's... Let's see. Hey. Let's run over here. I think I saw some cobblestone. I guess I could just dig down and get some cobblestone. But I want to get some coal too. We're going to go in there. We're going to go in that temple right off here. As soon as I find some goodies. 
Let's run around and think it's faster. Uh, let's collect you. You're going to be helpful. While wow, that water's dark. Let's keep going. I don't know where the sun's at. I really don't care. It must be above us. Um, actually, is there some exposed cobblestone here? There you go. Thank you. Alright, I see any coal exposed out there. Is that a roof forest already? It sure is. Uh, I don't see any coal though. I guess I can always burn some wood. Alright, let's just do enough to get a furnace and some tools. Alright, let's hop down right here and um, make some, some important things that we need, such as... Such as, such as, a new pickaxe, and a sword. That's kind of strange behavior. There's a sword. Whoa. That's, um, uh, that's not what I meant. Oh my gosh, it's kind of weird. The clicking is a little different, though. Make a new one of those guys. What are we missing? A shovel. We need a sh shovel. There we go. All right, let's get out of here and get back to that temple. Let me organize my bar a little bit. Oh, oh. oh my gosh, I keep missing my clicks. I want, whoa, that's weird. I want that handy. And I want my shovel goes over, no, my shovel goes over here now. I kind of changed how I do things. Oh, uh, we don't. Okay, let's go like this, like this. Blocks to be, be prepared, like so. Alright, um, what am I missing? Torches, which we'll make. And what am I missing there? Can't remember what I'm missing there. Why am I drawing a blank on how I Minecraft? Anyway, we don't have any protection, but I'm going to go and... Oh, you know what I should probably do first? Hmm... Well, we're going to do this anyway. Come here. Come here. Can I spam click in this? Oh, you can spam click in this. I don't know if I like that or not. Seems kind of cheesy if you can spam click, but that's okay. Because in PC edition, of course, you have to be careful about um, timing your attack. So there could be something alive in here that wants to come get us. Let's see. Anybody? Anybody home? Okay, that's nice. Okay, well, let's um, let's get this place into home here. Why don't we have any monsters in here? Whatever, don't argue, right? Just take care of it. All right, let's make a furnace. And we need a furnace. No, that's not what I meant, but whatever. Um, can I do that to make some charcoal? To make some torches? Oh yeah, there could be something up there. Forgot about that. Alright, let's um... Since we're trying to keep this place looking nice... Whoa. Let's put you like this and let's... Oh my gosh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Um, does something just come after us here? Let's take you... And let's make some... I guess I'm going to get four torches out of... Why is it having a hard time clicking? That's kind of weird and annoying, but whatever. That's not what he meant. And right, let's light you up a little bit. There we go. Now we're all lit up. And we're lit up there. What about up here? I don't think anything can actually jump down, right? Um. Oh, there's skeleton? Nope. Anything up there? I don't see anything. Okay. Alright. Let's see. That gives us some charcoal. Let's... Uh, we're going to burn our last piece of wood, aren't we? We're running low on wood already. Alright. Uh, let's put a piece of meat in there. That's not good. Why is this clicking so off? Let's try to keep up on that charcoal. Let's um make a few more torches. What? Nope. Weird. Yeah, there's something up there. There's a, there's something, something that wants to get us. 
Man, I'm having a really hard time clicking stuff around here. There's a donkey. Donkey's nice to have around. There we go. Now we got some proper food. I still can't remember what to keep in that spot because water goes there. Uh, oh, my bow and arrow, which I don't have right now. All right, let's go up here and see if we can get attacked by anything. Anything up here? Oh, yeah, let's not do that. Let's keep that closed. Oh, man. I really don't want to waste a pair. There you go. And a sight. I knew you'd come in handy. There we go. Now we can light you up properly. Knowing that's your way out, possibly, if we need to. Where is that torch slip on the last side? There we go. Now we're all lit up. I guess something could spawn and drop down on our head. Um, before we do that, let's... let's uh, I guess we can just... I was going to make it a plank. So we don't lose everything, or a um, slap, so we don't lose everything, but whatever. All right, let's hop down here. We should be safe up here. And let's go see then what loot we might already have. So there's some more meat. Uh, I don't think I want to waste that yet. All right, let's um, move that over there, put you over here. I want to use this wooden pickaxe up. So let's, we have enough torches. I think it's this one. How can I not remember? Yep, there we go. All right. Um, let's go down this way. Anything down there? I guess I should think about that first, huh? Safety first. Is there anything down there going to get us? Before we just pop on down. Let's throw a torch. Oh, I'm seeing dynamic lighting. Oh my gosh. Not having dynamic lighting is really throwing me for a loop. Still nothing, I guess nothing would spawn down there. If it did, it could... Oh, that made me jump out of my skin. I guess if something did spawn down there, it would could step on the thing and really screw up our trap. Which we don't want to set off. Right, we're almost done. We're almost done. All right, here we go. All right, put you there, and then take you out. Then there we go. Good. All right, do we need more torches down here? I don't think so. What do we have? Okay, well that. So can I shift click, double click thing? Can I go? Nope. The shift click thing doesn't work. But the mod, the, um, oh, that'd be nice. The, um, oh my gosh, what am I trying to say? The, oh, uh, animations are nice. Um, we're going to take the chest too. Oh, I hear a villager? No. Ooh, hey, look at this. That's nice to have. I'll just take all this stuff, I guess. String, okay, we can maybe make a bed then right away. That will be nice to have. I, well, we don't really have a need for another horse armor, but we might have to. Oh my, I'm, ha wow, there's a lot of loot. What? This is awesome. I forgot that about console edition. There's a lot more loot in your loot chests. Now, I know this is technically the better together update but it's based on console edition which has better loot in their loot chests you have to trust me on that uh, I don't really uh, fine what's this sandstone I don't care about the different sandstones I just want the sandstone I really feel like I should take another horse armor oh whoops now I got all that crap I don't need let's go up here why does it like there's a villager? All right, get rid of you. I don't need all these horse armors. I'm sorry. I'll just let them despawn, despawn. Um, two diamonds. I guess we can make a diamond sword right off the get-go here. That'd be nice to have. Ooh, this can kind of darken the side. Let's make that lighter. All right. Well, let's make a diamond sword. Um, 
Yeah. I don't know what else we need that for right off the bat. Where are my sticks? I know they're there somewhere. Look at that. Nice. Alrighty. So, let's see. What should we do? Should we explore the area? We have no... Well, should I try to make a bed? Try to remember how much string you need to make wool. There you go. Come on, I'm trying to... There we take that. Do I have anything to make dye with? So I don't have to have a white bed. Nope. We just can have a white bed. There you go. White bed. Nice. We're gonna bring that bed with us though. I'm not gonna even bother trying to set spawn here. We're right next to spawn. What can I get rid of? Because we're already full. I would be getting some other well, we can get rid of that. Okay, whatever. Um I have to pick up this stuff. And like I said, we're already full. Okay, there's that. Do I have room for this? I do. Okay. Well, there you go. Um, I guess we can keep going. We don't need to end the episode quite yet. It's still dark. I don't really feel like running all the dark right now. Let's throw this bed down super fast. Oh, I got some more terracotta. Yes, I will get some terracotta someday. You know how much I love terracotta. Whoops. So right now, let's sleep. Just to make it daytime. There you go. Let's pick that up. And I guess we can keep our bed there. Let's put a crafting table there. You get out of here. Oh, see, my clicks keep missing everything. Oh, yes, crafting on the left, by the way, in case you weren't aware of that. Um, what else do we need? We'll keep some of this other stuff. We'll get rid of it if we don't need it. I really want some more torches, but we need some coal. So, all right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to look at our map. We're going to head out and head this way. That's what we're going to do. So let's get ready to run because there are things that don't despawn, such as husks. Except I don't see anything. All right, good. Huh, not so scary. All right, let's um get some acacia. Any creepers? I guess let's check for creepers. I'm trying to use Optifine. Use C for Optifine. Let's get some of this wood just because I don't know if we're going to see another one of these. And, um, there's a spider. He's going to leave me alone, though. And I got plenty of string. I really don't want to whack him on accident. Alright, I really want to get some acacia saplings, too. This is where I just was. Did they drop anything for me here? Any oh! Oh, skeleton, just wait. Why is he coming after me? Wait a second. Why does he... It was this guy. Which, again, I can't... I don't have a shield, so... Wait, what the heck? What? You see how much health he took away from me? Holy cow! I don't have any shields. What are you supposed to do about that? I guess you just got to be good at the game, which I probably am not. Okay, I really want a doggone sapling to make this worth my trouble. Don't they drop very often? Oh, anyway. Alrighty. I feel like the most confused noob there is. Am I going the right way? What well, we got to eat. Alright, got my sapling. I'm happy. That's all I needed. Just the one. There's that other tree I chopped down. Well, he just disappeared. Alrighty, let's um get some food. I see some cows. So let's get some food going here, and then we'll head out. Keep heading out. Looking for... Whoa. Oh yeah, I forgot. Spam click. And my inventory's full. We don't need... We don't need... We don't need spider eyes. There we go. Ooh, here's some more saplings. Nice. And let's try the spam click thing. Yep, spam click piece of cake. Um, we also don't need apples. There we go. All right, well, am I going the right direction? Make sure, see, I already turned. Ah, I'm trying to put that map. All right, let's keep heading this way. Um, do I need more space for that? We don't need this thing. There we go. Alright. Um, let's 
keep going this way, I guess. Until we find somewhere we can build something. I have a feeling our first house is going to be an underground hut somewhere because I want to do a lot more exploring before I settle down. I don't want to just do the thing where I start a house and stay there and never go anywhere else for ever. You know what I mean? I want to um, actually find some stuff. Oh boy, I need to cook my food soon. And I'm gonna explore you for a minute. Actually, where are we going? Do we get turned around? Nope, we'll keep heading this way. Um, I'm gonna head for those hills, I think. And I'll meet you there. Oh, looks like we've come upon a village. I think. Well, that's nice. I didn't expect to see a village. And we're off the map. We're not even on the map anymore. Um, I was going for those hills to see if there's coal, but there isn't. So I was going to go to those hills and see if there's coal. Wait, there are two villages? There's a village there and a village here. Now remember, this better together is based on council, which means biomes are very small and villages are close together. So yeah, we have two separate villages here. Well, that's cool. Awesome. Let's see what they've got. And, um... Not gonna be able to raid their f stuff for food because oh, there's doors on them. Hey, they have doors now. Some don't have doors before. Alrighty, well, nice. Okay, this is cool. I'm really most interested in this one, of course. Let's see. Um, yeah, that'd be nice to have. And I could actually use the bread right now. I'm really hungry. But um, let's see. What else do they have here? Oh. Besides pain. Um, very cool. Well, let's run over this other village. Where was it? Over here? I think the village was over there. And I think that's where we'll end up camping out for the night. So I can cook my stuff. I got a lot of food to cook. I'm getting hungry. I'm avoiding eating raw food if I can help it. Just because it's better saturation if it's cooked. And it's getting dark. So we're going to have to make a run for it here. Um, because if I get attacked, I'm not going to heal. Yeah, there's zombies underground. I hear ya. Okay, good. Let's, um, let's barricade her. Is there another blacksmith here with an oven? Or do I have to... I don't see a blacksmith here. Alright, let's go in here then. Yep, I'm going to use you. And I'm going to actually block the... Yeah, see, I did that on purpose. See? So that I can take over your home here. Just for right now, just so I can eat something. And what am I doing? And let's see here. Let's go. Oh my gosh, I still only have the one piece of coal. Doggone what I have most of. Most of those. Um, Alright, well, let's cook this up quick and eat, and then we'll call it a day. Alright, we can finally eat something. I'm going to have to eat both of them, aren't I? Alright, sorry to disrupt your village there, everybody, but, um,. I really needed to eat that food. So, we have one torch left. Oh, not enough to cook that one piece of meat. Inventory is pretty much full. We got our acacia. Just because I don't know we're going to see that again. We have some oak. I guess I make that in the slabs. We have a bunch of good stuff to get us started. We have a bed even. What we need to do, though, is find some basic resources like coal. So that we can actually continue exploring a little bit. Like I said, we're off the map. It'd be nice to kind of fill out this map a little bit. So head a little bit north and east again, but um, I keep thinking I keep thinking that's an item. To, uh, whatever. Anyway, so um, that'd be the episode, folks. Like my other council videos that I made, um, we found villages and temples right off the bat. But like I said, this is Windows 10 edition, better together, based on council though and pocket edition. So of course. Biomes are smaller, and I already said all that. So we had a good start. We need to find some coal. We got to find some iron. We got to do some caving right off the bat. So that's what we'll be doing in the next episode. But until then, we'll see you next time.